17 ways lawyers can use the metaverse to stand out above all the noise. It doesn't matter what you do for a living. The fact of the matter is that there's a lot of competition out there. It's never been more challenging to get your voice, business, and brand noticed. While I'm sharing this information for all my fellow lawyers around the world, the fact of the matter is that most of these tips will help almost anyone build their brand, business, occupation, and profession. But remember, just hearing about these techniques isn't going to get you to where you want to go. You must take action, massive focused action, to see results. Take these metaverse strategies and build a new and better brand. Tap into this new technology to remain relevant moving forward. What you already know and do in the real world to connect, persuade and close deals works well in the metaverse. There's no need to reinvent the wheel. Double down on your existing strengths when embracing these new methods to connect and build your brand. Now please pay attention, because this is important. Here's the initial premise of everything I discuss in this audio post. It goes as follows. If you want to blend in and be like everyone else in town, do what everyone else is doing. If you want to stand out above all the noise and build a brand unlike anyone else, be different. Give yourself permission to try new things, embrace new technology, and do what others are not willing to do. I believe with all else being equal, the easiest, most effective, and most impactful way to stand out in today's world is to embrace and create your brand in the metaverse. For good reason, it's the hot topic of conversation, and in five years, every major lawyer and law firm will be offering services from their virtual spaces. Some of us are already meeting clients, opposing counsel, and expert witnesses in the different metaverse spaces. Lawyers and other business owners are doing these 17 things right now to go from unknown to unforgettable. You can too. One more thing. When reviewing these options, keep bar association rules and ethics in mind. Okay, ready to get started? Good. Here are my 17 tips. Number 1. Create a Metaverse Mindset What we've done is set up a virtual office and conference room to complement our traditional law firm and client services. We also have created a conference facility that can host hundreds of people. Our Metaverse office is simply a new digital welcome mat that we offer to facilitate engagement and meetings. It doesn't replace our in-real-life traditional firm, but it does add to the ways people can communicate and meet with us from the other side of town or anywhere in the world. Just like sharing a Zoom link, we now offer clients, experts, opposing counsel, and even claims adjusters the option of taking a meeting in one of our virtual spaces. Everyone in the firm is trained to promote, access, and use our metaverse spaces. Although the virtual spaces we use can be accessed by a phone, tablet, laptop, or desktop, using a virtual reality headset improves the experience by 95%. Right now we are recommending the Oculus Quest 2 because it's inexpensive and compatible with the top metaverse platforms we enjoy using. I don't want to spend too much time trying to convince you about how great the metaverse is. Doing so in this here is like trying to give you a haircut over the telephone. It's just not going to happen. Putting on a headset like the Oculus Quest 2 and spending an hour or two on the different metaverse platforms will help you understand why the metaverse is so powerful, important, and is already changing everything we know. Number 2. Create a unique metaverse brand. Stand out from your competition by being one of the first law firms to offer metaverse and virtual office options. Incorporate your metaverse presence into your everyday conversations. Share approaches with your team so they can learn how to incorporate and suggest the use of your metaverse services into everyday client conversations. Just like smart lawyers did back in the day when fax machines, email, and websites first rolled out, include your metaverse option in all your daily communications and branding. Almost everything you and your team say and do can incorporate this new firm asset and option. Being a player in this new space will improve and expand your brand. Number 3. Offer meetings in your virtual office or conference room. Now that you're up and running in the metaverse and actively promoting this virtual option to clients, opposing counsel, experts, claims adjusters, and anyone else you're doing business with, start making the meetings happen. The next time someone wants to meet with you at your office or on a Zoom, respond with, that sounds great. How about we set up the meeting in our virtual office? I'll send you a link, just like a Zoom, 
and we can review everything together in our virtual conference room. Even if the other person isn't interested in dipping their toes in the virtual sandbox, you'll pique their interest. They'll be sharing what you're doing with others. And if they do take you up on your offer, they'll be blown away by the experience. When's the last time that's happened with someone meeting you at your office? Number 4. Virtual Courtroom Invite clients into your virtual courtroom. Walk them through the process and have them take a seat at the counsel table or the witness stand. Help them get comfortable with how things work in the courtroom before they ever walk through the actual courtroom doors. Number 5. Breaking News Stories When there's breaking news that you would like to offer commentary on, hold an informal news conference with Q&A in your virtual conference room. Promote and share the link using all your communication and social media channels. Just the fact that you're holding the conference in the metaverse will in and of itself attract attention, conversation, and engagement. Number 6. Free weekly or monthly seminars. Hold a weekly how-to seminar with active Q&A on topics your clients need to know. Incorporate trending news stories to generate interest. Bring in experts as guests to interview and answer questions. Number 7. Associate, Partner, and Team Member Profiles Shine a bright light on the human side of lawyers, partners, and support team members. Everyone in your practice has a story to tell. Help them tell these amazing stories. Bring them into a cozy virtual stage environment. The platforms we use offer warm and casual spaces for interviews and conversation. Human interest stories connect us and build rapport. Number 8. Client Stories We all have amazing clients. Several times a month, bring in a client and share who they are and what they do with the world. Make the event all about the client and not about you or your firm. Coordinate the promotion of your event ahead of time with links and access information. Ask your client to share the event with his audience. More exposure means more engagement. Sometimes, it even means more business. Number 9. Virtual Conference Hold quarterly virtual conferences that share tips and add value to your clients or the general public. It's as easy and inexpensive to create a space for an audience of 500 as it is for a group of 10. Leverage this power. In the law, and most industries and professions, things change quickly. Everyone is interested in staying on top of current trends and best practices. Be the firm that adds value in a way others have never even thought about. Number 10. Settlement Conferences Participate in settlement conferences in your virtual space. Invite a claims adjuster or opposing counsel to join you in your virtual conference room. Use the available tools to share photograms, videos, and exhibits on large screens. Complement your presentation with the use of a whiteboard. Import 3D objects and manipulate them while handing them back and forth with the other participants. Create a settlement presentation where you walk through a long hallway showing and discussing, in chronological order, what happened in your case. As you do so, you're walking by photos, videos, and exhibits placed on a wall or floating in the air. Believe it or not, it only takes a few minutes to set these experiences up, and the impact of your one-of-a-kind virtual presentation may help you get your case settled. After all, I can hear the other side saying, If Mitch took this much time to create this virtual settlement meeting, imagine how prepared he'll be and the powerful presentation he'll put on at the time of trial. For the non-lawyers listening to this post, imagine doing a product demonstration or closing a deal using this same approach. Powerful stuff, right? Number 11. Do your next podcast or video interview from the metaverse. The next time you create a podcast or video, think about doing so from your virtual office or conference room space. We use metaverse spaces that look like an expensive interview stage or TED Talk platform. Why not raise the bar, do something unique, and record your next show from the metaverse? Not only will everyone enjoy your interview, but they'll also tell everyone they meet where and how it took place. Number 12. Legal Updates When new laws come out that affect your clients, promote and hold a live queue and a session from your Metaverse conference room. 
It's fun, different, and works well. Number 13, Community Events. Shine a bright light on community events you support by inviting community leaders to your Metaverse talk show. Share event details and links with your audience. Do all you can to add value to the other person and event. If you do, I guarantee your guest will let everyone in her community know about what you did and how you did it in the Metaverse. Number 14, Client Testimonials. When appropriate, bring a happy client into your Metaverse office and have him share his story. Incorporate pictures and videos into the conversation. Bring in family members to add context to the story. Number 15, Hobbies, Interests, and Passions. Create a space where others who share your hobbies, interests, and passions can meet and share projects, ideas, and events. A comfortable Metaverse lounge would be a great place for a book club meeting. Make sure to keep the conversation away from the law and focus on the common interests everyone has. Remember that you're facilitating a conversation and not promoting your firm. Weekly or monthly get-togethers are a great way to build and leverage these relationships. Number 16, Case Studies. If you're an intellectual property lawyer and you're advising the non-fungible token space, hold presentations and Q&A sessions in your virtual conference room on trending intellectual property legal issues or stories. There's a reason why everyone is talking about a particular news story. Inject yourself into the conversation instead of simply watching it happen from the outside. Number 17, Movie Night and Repurposing Existing Content. One very cool feature that the metaverse allows is to host a big screen presentation of your existing video or slide deck on a large screen. You and your audience can sit in a large auditorium or even on the deck of a yacht and watch the movie together while enjoying quiet conversation through spatial audio. You can also take existing blog posts, podcast episodes, and video content and repurpose them on the metaverse. What you wrote in a post or discussed in a podcast can be shared from the virtual stage to an audience of 10 or 500. What worked well on Instagram or your website will work even better in the metaverse. The options for this kind of approach are only limited by your imagination. Conclusion Since the dawn of humanity and the first campfire made by humans, we've been fascinated with coming together and sharing experiences and stories. The global virtual campfires we are now building in the different metaverses take this experience to the next level. And yes, we are already hanging out and toasting marshmallows around digital campfires. Here's the deal. The law firms that embrace this new technology into their client services and brands will be the same law firms standing out from all the noise. They'll be the lawyers and law firms leading the way and who others are talking about. New referrals and business will come your way because you're leading instead of simply following. I believe this is your moment in time to bring the metaverse to your practice. Take a few minutes and listen to this audio again. Next, review all the issues to my LinkedIn newsletter and over at my blog, nichjackson.com. Give thought to using the metaverse to raise the bar and create new client experiences. Take action and start this week. Do what other lawyers are unwilling to do and join us in becoming a player in the new and exciting virtual worlds. This post was brought to you by Mitch Jackson, an award-winning 2009 Orange County Trial Lawyer of the Year and a 2013 California Litigation Lawyer of the Year. Mitch enjoys applying his three-plus decades of practicing law to add value to consumers and clients who are doing the digital dance at the intersection of law, business, and technology. The best place to stay connected with Mitch is at his blog, MitchJackson.com.